Chef Fred, how you doing, man? How you doing, Ben? What's on the menu today? Today we're grilling up some mahi with a citrus seasoning. With that, we're gonna have a roasted pepper puree with ginger added to it on stir-fried vegetables and Okinawan sweet potatoes. All right, sounds good. Go Let's for get it. Going. So we're gonna do, we have some beautiful mahi today. Just gonna put a little bit of seasoning. With this, I have some dried zest of both lemon and lime. Salt okay. and pepper. Okay. What does drying the zest do? Well, it just actually helps it adhere to the fish too. Oh, so. Okay. I know you spent a lot of years in Waikiki and now you're out here in the country in Haleiwa. How's that fitting? You gotta love the country, man. It's oh, yeah? just beautiful here. And you know, not only is it neat to be in the country, but having our farmers right down the street just makes everything so much nicer too. On your collection of vegetables here on the uh, prep table, oh. what do we got here? Just like we were talking about, again, some of our local products, we're also getting some of this baby bok choy coming from Terry Shinsaku as well. As, and then we have our kukusi asparagus, which is something really new that they're growing out by the old fish ponds. Have you seen that before, the sea asparagus? No, I have not. Really? This is new for me. You know what's really cool about it is that when you taste it, since it's grown entirely in salt water, it's naturally salty, so you don't really need a season as mm -hmm. much. So we're just gonna start with our vegetables. Added just a touch of some olive oil. Putting in our sea asparagus, as well as some broccolini. <laughs> You like that? like broccoli and I like enokis. Good. So it's not broccoli, it's broccolini. Broccoli, okay. You say broccoli. Okay. You got carrots, you got onions, you got all kinds of stuff yeah. in there. Now this right. portion we're looking at, this is the average portion you have in the restaurant on the menu? Sure is. It's a lot of food, man. Which is my kind of place. Good, good. Okay, we're gonna just add in just a touch of some vegetable stock. Vegetable stock, that's a reduction of what kind of... Um... Mirepoix, uh -huh. which consists of onion, carrot, celery, and then I also take some trimming from our mushrooms. These a lot of... Uh, Enokis are from Hamakua as well, so a lot of our trimming from the mushrooms go into the stock too. That's a lot of fish, man. Uh, it's two pieces, about three ounces each, so mm -hmm. about six ounce portion. Okay, we have a little bit of prepared sauce, again with a touch of... Uh, we have vegetable stock, a little bit of soy, garlic, and ginger. Okay. All right? Easy enough. We got all that in our homes. Okay, so we're just going to let this simmer a little bit, okay? As our fish is cooking, I'm going to explain to you the, the puree sauces that we have. No butter, no fats. Simply, all we do is we take bell peppers. We have both red and yellow and roast them. I usually use a torch or just put them right on the grill, mm. okay? And then to that, I add uh, oil that consists of lemongrass ginger, garlic, and cilantro, which has all been pureed into the oil. Okay, so we're gonna take this. Now we're just gonna simply take our puree sauces. We're gonna take our roasted yellow bell pepper. And our roasted red bell pepper. Hey, you know what? Even though it looks great, no one knows if it tastes great. So we're gonna be right back, folks. Don't go away, we're gonna come right back and see if this tastes as good as it looks. Hey, welcome back to the show, folks. If you just joined us, we're with Chef Fred D'Angelo at Ola's in the beautiful Kui Lima, right? Yes, sir, Ola and Turtle Bay. Great dish, Chef. Can you describe that again for us? Sure, what we have is a citrus grilled mahi that's on a bed of Okinawan sweet potatoes, some nice local fresh uh, vegetables, including our kuku sea asparagus, Topped with a roasted pepper, both red and yellow, ginger puree. Good stuff. Wow, look at this mahi, man. It's perfect. Ooh. Not overcooked oh, at man, all. It's beautiful. All right. Chef. That's wonderful. So easy, too. You know, nice, simple. Worth the ride. Worth that 20 minute ride out to where you're working. Yeah. You can see how those fresh ingredients really make a difference. Right on, chef. One bite's not going to be enough. I'm going to finish it, okay? Okay, very good. Thanks. I'll get you a napkin. <laughs> Thanks for being with us. And folks, thank you to all the fishermen that were on the show and everybody else. It's only going to be a week. We'll see you next week on Let's Go Fishing. Aloha. <laughs> all right. All right, chef. This, good job. I need some rice, man. I know.